go. Puppy's cuddled up against my arm. I gotta get a blanket. Give me a sec. Grabbing a blanket. Grabbing a blanket. And for long, not a Mega Man. Mega Man. Mega Man. <laughs> I got my dog finally accustomed to the bed, which is funny because now she doesn't like her cage. Okay. Should be ready to go. Rainy Turtleoid. And I'll be zero. And I need to open up my stream channel. Fucking fly, you cunt. <laughs> Leave me alone. Oh, press it down on the analog stick. Important cultural asset. Why does the nightmare phenomena have to happen here in one place? Good plotting. Better save the reploids. Counting on you, Zero. On my way, Elliot. Oh, fuck you, too. I, oh, you cunt. Saved your cut. Oh fuck, I forgot the rain was gradually hurting me. A blonde moment. The generator, kill me, bitch. Why is this level like just cancerous as shit? I died. Side of that bitch. 
I come the fuck on, game. Oh, my puppy's gotten used to the bed. She's, she's just chilling in front of me. God damn it, you kind of swaggins. I'm not meaning to dash. Oh, come the fuck on. You know, I'm just gonna suicide to help the person. Maybe she'll give me something. You're a cunt. I suck. <laughs> to be fair, I haven't been playing for a while. I think I'm gonna keep my game up. I, uh, is it would work? For some reason, my friends will be little bitches. I can't the fuck on. Are you fucking with me? So, I don't know what the fuck's going on with him, nor do I care anymore at this point. They're not gonna fucking talk to me or tell me what the fuck's going on. Fighting them to parties when I see that they're on. with Juicy and my cousin lately, which is kind of the older crew that I was playing with back in the day. Uh, I've been playing with Juicy since Destiny 1. The constant fucking bullshit with the rain. The low passage, it's too narrow to walk into, but maybe there's another way. Maybe X can handle it because his body is a little smaller than yours. That's bullshit. A fucking. A literal. Oh, you have to be this player to proceed. Type esque shit, and I know. Wish I can save you. Come the fuck on. Look, 
There's one. Uh, my friends might get back on whenever I start playing, uh, probably the new Fallout and, uh, the, uh, new Division. I bet that's probably a new kicker. You see, he'll never leave. He has, he has, like, moments where he's just gone for a few He always comes back because of what he's there. Uh, the rest of them, it's, it's kind of weird. Bottom right of you, I think, is able to take damage. So all these guys are reploids that have died and been brought back to life. Okay, yeah, his the bottom right of him, I saw it from a speedrunner, is like for some reason not got an invincibility uh point. So if I can do the spam dash hit, I can probably just fuck him. I guess I can just fight him the casual way. Oh, come the fuck on, you cock tease. I gotta admit, I've done two streams of this, but in all honesty, if I had a day where I just had a lot of free time, I could probably down this in too easy long streams. It's just that one day I went to go play with Monster Hunter with Juicy, but I had to go to the grocery store. And then by the time I got back, it was like midnight and passed out in my chair till four in the morning. <laughs> Back down, you're a cunt. You are a bitch. 
This entire boss fight is stupid because he's so massive. There have been two boss fights where just massive shit has been thrown at you, and one where you were fighting another, literally this boss as a giant donut. It's hard to believe that they went straight from this game to the full 3D shit. There's no indicator of fucking when he's gonna go up or right. There's no pattern. It's random. It's not Mega Man at all. This boss is just the worst thing I've ever fucking experienced. He's not difficult. He's just stupid. I hope the dude who made him lost his job. That was the stupidest fight ever. That was not a like proper massive fight like in the previous games where you fight massive robots instead. That's that was just like it was like a dick measuring contest. The stupid. Oh, does the puppy want to cuddle? Does she want to cuddle with me? Huh? Does the puppy want cuddle? Oh, she's such a sweetheart. She's been so well behaved. Wait, did none of those guys I sur I saved have like any items? So fucking stupid. Okay, next boss. I 
Oh, so that boss apparently dictated where you're standing. Metal Shark. It's the next one I should fight. Little gay intro cutscene song bullshit. Metal Shark Player. So they they changed Duff McWhalen to like Wave Whale or whatever, but they like changed that one. Oh, come on. The stagger bullshit from damage has been fucking me this entire game. Like, the whole fact that you cannot move. Really fucking bullshit. Oh, goodness, my puppy dog. She's just chilling. What? Oh, <laughs> I turned to look at my dog and died. <laughs> Except the charges. Zero's fucking size is a factor in this game. That is the dumbest thing. Oh my. That is. I suck at this game. I want to die slowly. God won't let me.
Oh my. That. I didn't mean to swipe you cunt. Also, if I, oh, but if I hold down and hit the fucking Z saber, he does the flip, so I immediately die. That's fun. Wow, this game is a monument to inconveniences. Yard, like all this shit's going on. and I can still save him. Risking my neck to fucking save these assholes. The game itself is fucking me for doing it. I would get maybe losing a life. Ha <laughs> ha 
from this except for the nightmares you're a cunt who designed this fucking level should have been fired Your life doesn't matter no one loves you Nightmares in my existence. I just charge. I had shields. Why didn't I just fucking charge? Should have fucking killed you. Ah, I see. Ready, 
so I guess I should have taken the uh, down way. Cool. At least I know I can get past it now, but what the fuck, game? I was like, that's a portal. I probably shouldn't take that. It's going to lead me to the nightmare. I guess the portal is mandatory? Fucking first. I don't know how the fuck that damaged me like that, but I'll fucking take it. Thank Christ. The belt conveyor is moving. The nightmare should be doing this, but I can't see any changes in there. We don't know what will happen. Stay alert. At least I'm not bored. Ah, I see. Thanks, game. Thanks for that raw dog bullshit. Fucking cuck. Oh, I see one her tummy rubs. Ah, at least my dog likes me. Protective shield. Oh, I should bum rush that whole fucking thing. Man, the checkpoints here are unfucking forgiving. Hey, all your checkpoints in the last three games have been actually super generous. Then you just get to this game and you're like, you ain't the fucking carpet out from underneath them.
Once you get the pattern down, it's fine, but it's still like, god damn, this fucking sucks. This is two levels now that, like, just... What the fuck? I know you're trying to get, like, a theme down of, like, fucking nightmares and, like, bad shit happening, but, like... You're only pissing me off, game. I do like the concept of like Okay, this this is a fuck you moment. <sighs> wow. A section like that on a fucking movie. Like dude, who the what the fuck kind of sadist made this game? Were you so unhappy with the fact you couldn't end your game at fucking 6 that you like just tried to make set or at 5 that you tried to make 6 fail? So far, I've had the worst boss fight of my entire Mega Man playthroughs, which is the fucking Mecha Turtleoid. What the fuck, you game? <laughs> they let this game get away with way too much shit. Did they not have like fucking playtesters who were like, "Hey, you might wanna, you might wanna tweak that a bit." That. Uh, spike pit right after they finally think they've passed this yeah that's a bullshit moment spike pit. fucked me like the moment when you make a level to torture people that's when you know you're a fucking sadist with a game like Dark Souls and other shit that oh my god with a game like Dark Souls, that one's on me. I'll admit to that. A game like Dark Souls, you know, what you get from the get-go. And yeah, you expect Mega Man games to be hard, but like... Platforming, really? It's gotta be like... Next level shit? At this point, I've stopped giving a fuck. I was wondering why I was only playing like fucking hour sessions of this, and now I remember. Because it sucks. The donut level was a fucking torture fest. The rain level wasn't bad. The boss was a fucking shit show. This level is a fucking shit show. put time and effort into just fucking torturing people with multiple levels yeah that's that's a shit show maybe one on occasion two but like I feel like this is making a somewhat pattern not to mention with the nightmare effects
one in this yet. for the fucking sadist part that I doubt I'll be able to fucking beat but I can fucking try <sighs> you gotta like jump just right and dash but the problem is is that shit's fucking hard like when I beat this game I'm gonna enjoy the fact that I'm playing X7 the most hated game in the series because to me I hate this more I've played X7. I've beaten X7. I like X7. This game can go fuck itself. I actually have four people watching me. What the fuck? And then I have my friends sending me really weird messages. My old friends from high school. Not my gaming friends for some reason. Oh look, Juicy's watching me. Fuck, I forgot a duck. Ready? Just happy I made it through alive. God, dude, the guy that made this game should kill fuck himself. Oh, look at the puppy. So fat, fluffy. Ugh, my dog is being cool. As dog should. Recently bought her some puppy shears and then some rides. So that way she has something to chew on instead of like fucking wires and shit. The fact that these guys can go through everything and shoot you from a distance is horseshit. Fucking horseshit. Got this son of a bitch. I bet this is probably fucking easier with fucking Mega Man. Because he's apparently smaller. Which I'd kind of known, but like, to an extent. I didn't think it was that much of a difference that it impaired your gameplay. Prevented you from going down certain passageways. Which, by the way, super stupid decision. section. Oh, what the? I was trying to pace it so I wouldn't get caught up in the top. God damn it. I have been playing for an hour and I have beaten one level. I think.
Maybe two? No, I guess I did kill someone before with the turtle, didn't I? Yeah, what was the boss? What boss did I kill before the turtle? Guess not. Also, I should have killed the Blizzard Wolf Fang before coming to Metal Shark. Are there like three different rivers to even go through this game? That is stupid. Three different recommends at least. doesn't fucking let me dash. Also, that space is fucking constricting. I'd, I'd shudder to imagine how bad the levels are on with the fucking nightmare effects. Like, the levels are already the shittiest things I've ever touched with my hands. And I've never wanted to die so much more in my life. I want to die. I have beaten the last five games. Yes, they were difficult. God damn it, I did it. This game, I know I could fucking beat once I get past this shit, but like, <laughs> the fact that there's no fucking checkpoint, at least in the middle of this. <laughs> Nothing. Also, should have been able to jump that. dog is a hand rest while I put my controller down and she fucking loves it for some reason. Oh man, I miss King with his tips. He honestly helped me get through a lot of the Mega Man games. It probably would have taken me twice as long to get through Mega Man 2 without his help. The weakness factor, yeah. Some of the tricks and stuff like that were neat to know, but all in all, I just helped to have someone rooting for you in your chat. You have no idea how helpful that is whenever you're playing a fucking sadist game like this.
It's... Okay, when I try to dodge, the problem is, is the fucking box, like, like this fucking thing up here. The problem is, is... There's a stutter when I fall off. That really is one thing. Maybe I should stick to the right and then just fall. The problem is, is it's fucking small, so... God damn! If I was fucking Mega Man, this level would probably be easier, which is stupid. If that's even a fucking thought. This, this, this is sapping the life out of me. Get to it easy now, almost without dying. If not without dying. Now game, don't fuck me. Let me grip the wall. Also, why has there not been a single person to save along this path? That's the thing that pisses me off. What's the matter, pup? What's the matter? Just lie down. We're fine. Didn't mean to wake you up. To be honest, I think you woke up. Brains out. That's your job. The fact that I had to do that, show how stupid this fucking is. You're fine, dog. I'm not yelling at you. I'm yelling at the game for pissing me off. Perfectly normal. It's normal, I swear. Thank Christ, titty fuck McGee. Oh, no.
Please don't make me redo everything if I die here. For the love of God. Oh, thank Christ. I can just fight the fucking con again. Oh, it just spawned me right under fucking Ethan. How many bombs do you drop? Bad cunt. Are you a cunt? Go, I ran into this. Why? Why is the hitbox not working? What? I'm hitting it. There's still things on that side. What the fuck is going on? Try this, maybe? I feel like this level was specifically intended for Mega Man. And I got a message from Sean. I don't know what it says. Let's find out. I invited you earlier. God damn it.
got it. What the fuck was that? I was doing consistent damage, it just wouldn't die. This is going to be similar to the moth fight. Hey, one hit because it had no health. I don't know what to do, Shot. I've sent you two invites and you haven't driven. Fucking uh, work. Been working on a day shift or what? Stop it. Yeah. Well, I was working night shift, so I figured I, that was I work probably a, the reason. I work at a store. There's only there's only day shift. Ugh. I work at a local store. It's just like. With today, I had a lot of shit to do. Yeah. And, uh, our other two stock boys are left to go to Colorado for the week. Nice. So I'm the only- so I'm the only one left, so literally I have to do everything. <laughs> Catch my jam. That's just inappropriate. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Josiah hasn't been on at all. I figured. He'll like message me and reply, <laughs> like if I text him, but he doesn't <coughs> fucking get on the fucking Xbox. Huh. I don't know why. I don't know if his internet's gone down or anything, he doesn't know. fucking tell me. What's wrong with you? <laughs> what symbiotic, oh, organic life form has replaced you? It was you? probably the fact that it was, it was probably the shock from the fucking monitor wire that she was like, oh fuck. <laughs> I found out that the people at PetSense did beat her. Of course. Uh, guess who I found out? Hell. So wait, let me adjust my micro fast. Edit more towards game, so you were super quiet. Um, basically, you know how I told you she loves like females in general, and uh, my female roommate. And that kind of pisses yeah. me off. Yeah, like she's afraid of my female yeah. roommate, and she hasn't seen her since uh, she left on a trip. 
and she, she's every time afraid of your female roommate. Yeah, now she's afraid of her, and she gets in her lap and she acts like she's being beaten, and then she trips the fuck out. Uh, and then uh, fucking like just runs to me. And she like loves females, and I don't know what the fuck's going on. So and like the girls were over, you know, uh, the fucking little girls that John takes care of. Yeah. Uh, he's That's like their not uncle. Weird. He's like he's like their adopted uncle. <laughs> it's just the way you worded. I was like, hmm. probably. But anyway, uh, those little girls he takes care of. She loves okay. them, and she was playing with them, but I was like, what the fuck's wrong? Because Savannah was like, what the fuck's wrong with your dog? Because I was like, I have no fucking clue. I don't know what the fuck's going on. But I know I'm like, I know I'm not going to PetSense anymore, so I bought a fucking shear, and I'm just like, every time she needs a fucking haircut, I'll do that shit myself. Huh. So I'm like, well, fuck. You need a bath, fuck, you know that? How does your dog handle Baz? Pretty well. She doesn't, you can tell she doesn't really like them, but she's not opposed to them. She doesn't fight, she's like, eh. Like, just get it done. I think I'm just gonna start throwing a rawhide in the tub for mine. Yeah, rawhide is like the solution to all problems with dogs. It really is. No, Sean, can't I was sitting here. Can pee? Rawhide. What the fuck? I was sitting here the other day, and I was like, where the fuck is everybody? I know Josiah is off, but like, uh, I was like, what the fuck's going on? Oh my god. I've just been working really weird shifts, like... I figured that was what uh, I'm working... I'm working, uh, tomorrow I'm working fucking a split shift, and I want to die. So I've got to go in tomorrow at 8 o'clock? Get my phone, hold on. I have to go in at 8.30 for the truck in the morning. And then she's gonna have me after I finish the truck, I'm gonna come home and then I've gotta work at 3 to 7. God damn it. Uh, that but, sounds on the bright side I get paid. On the bright side I get paid. You gonna, so, you gonna get a Mars new memory card? I don't know yet. I still have things to do with the dog. Not expensive things, not like vaccines or anything. But, uh, I have to get, get her, her third set of shots. Yeah. Mine, the 31st. Yeah. Mine has a third set of shots. She has a rabies shot. She's had her heartworm medication. Uh, she has her flea and tick stuff done. Apparently I and now, all I, need, all I need to do with her right now is I need to get her her city tag. Her city tag? Yeah. Oh. Fuck is a city tag. Yeah, you take you take the rabies shot papers into your like city office and you show it to them and you pay like three bucks and they give you like a registered tag. So that if she goes missing they have her like on registry. Huh. So that way like the so, so, so that way like animal control can't pick her up off the street and take her to the town. Oh it stops. Like if she takes off it? they can't Yeah. If, if she's wearing her city tag, they can't take her to, like, the pound or the main society. They have to pick her up and keep her and contact me. Why does Zero have a Mega Buster? With the Super Double Ultra Mega Nut Buster combined. Oh! I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, no. I've just been like, I've been playing with Juicy lately, and I'm like, this is weird. Yeah. I was, like, where the fuck? Give me a cat. I was like, where the fuck is everybody? Yeah, I've just been handling shit. And I've been at my dad's a few times, so I've been visiting him. Ah. You and your dad getting along? So far. Not usually get along. Just depends on the day. Ah! Ah, I got ripped. I'm upset,
you know, I'm I'm really pissed at fucking my dog, but I'm also like in a in a in a in a non fucked up way. I'm kind of happy because she's not attached to Savannah anymore. Something good came out of it, but I'm still pissed. Yeah, which is fair. Like the means don't justify the ends. Yeah. My god, I need a haircut. I have not dealt with haircuts since I got out of school. Damn. I got one like uh, a month and a half ago. Fixing to start school up again. It's... School is starting in less than a week for me and I'm fucking terrified. Oh yeah. It's gonna be your first time at a college. Yeah. By the way, uh, Caitlyn Ray dyed her yeah. hair platinum blonde. Nice. And she's moving up to the Fort Hayes dorm Sunday. Uh, does that mean she's down to date, or <laughs> she's just moving up here? I don't know. I don't I... know. Can you chill the fuck out, dog? Oh my Please. god! I got stabbed in the nipples! <laughs> Not the nipples! Right in the fucking nipples. God damn it, Jim Bob! God damn it! God damn it, Bobby! <laughs> my cousin can do Hank Hill's uh, voice impression like perfectly, and it's terrifying. Yeah. So I hear Bryce got, uh, sworn into the Marines. Yeah, apparently he didn't tell my fucking dad about it. <laughs> or the whole entire, my father's side of the family, he's just like, nah, fuck them. He didn't even tell me. The only reason I saw it was the fucking message from him. He's like, dude, I'm on my way to get sworn into the Marines. I was like, dude, that's badass as fuck. <laughs> Congratulations, he's gonna be the first Marine for getting kicked out for being gay. Wait, or can they not kick you out for being gay anymore? What? I said, can they not kick you out of the Marines for being gay anymore? No. I see. Why? I was curious, because sometimes I wonder about Bryce. That's fair. <laughs> That's a fair point. So, Bryce has been fucking messaging me now. Sean. Like more. Sean. Rape I'm whistle. Like, Why, Bryce? Uh, it's what? because he wants to get along with you because you're one of my friends. And he wants to be a part of our, like, friend group. But I'm like, I'm like, sitting here like, if you're in the Marines, you won't be playing Xbox for a few years. Yeah, you ain't gonna be playing Xbox for a few years. You're gonna come back and, like... He's gonna come back and, like... Everyone's gonna be different. Everyone's gonna be dead, and there's just gonna be, like, a fucking cybernetic zombie eating his Xbox. He's gonna be like, oh, God! What happened? <laughs> what is... What has transpired here? You do realize that since he's a Marine now, I can make all the jokes that my dad told me about Marines since he was in the Corps. But that they're gay? No. <laughs> they're dumb. <laughs> they are dumb. Are you kidding me? Bryce no, being allowed not. to hold a fucking gun? Think about that. They're allowing my dipshit brother to handle firearms. Why do I have a fucking milk carton tab in my pocket? Where did this come from? I must have put it in my pocket at work. No, but like, my dad and my brother- Literally my entire dad's side of my family is- We're in the movie. Because my dad was, uh, in motor team explosives. My brother served three tours to Iraq. 
uh, I don't know what, uh, my aunt is still current, is in the Air Force currently, and she's like 72. Jesus. She's gonna, she always, she's gonna spit salmonella on them with her dentures. She's like a logistics expert at the Air Force, at one of the Air Force bases in California. God, I forgot my family's so fucking old. Yep. Fucking ancient. Um, what else is there? Uh, my uncle, my uncle, it's gonna sound weird, I have a lot of uncles with like, the basic names. Uh, my uncle Steve. <laughs> I have two Uncle Steves, because <laughs> my, my dad's side of my family isn't creative. <laughs> Confusion! No, but uh, my Uncle Steve, one of them, <laughs> is a senior drill instructor at a Marine Corps boot camp. And then the other one did serve in the Marines, he doesn't now, he's like a, he's an electrician in Arizona. I'm an electrician that'll fuck you up. Pretty much. But, uh, I remember talking to my dad about, uh, him in the Marine Corps because he was motor T and explosives. And the yeah. only reason that he was and explosives was because they didn't have anyone that had taken any classes on explosives and they just kind of gave him an upgrade. So, he got to handle thermite while he was in the Marine Corps. That's hot. Yep. Very. There. I hate you. Uh, no, but he got to handle Freedom Land and they let him run like, uh, like tests with it. They had him rent it because he served during the Cold War. Jesus, how fucking old are your parents? He served during the Cold War when it was towards the end of the Cold War. But. He was qualified to drive any armored vehicle, he was qualified to drive tanks, uh, and then he was technically qualified to carry thermite, which at the time was completely legal. You could use thermite. You can't use thermite now. You can't use it as like a form of attack. Yeah. Thermite has been banned because it's inhumane. That's stupid. That's not stupid, because they used to have thermite- OW! They used to have thermite grenades that you would throw. It was also known as, uh, WP. It's fucking thermite. Uh, and they would take them, and basically it was just, you take it, throw it, and, like, it off, it fucking spreads it everywhere. And if it gets stuck to people, it doesn't come off. <laughs> You're gonna die today, boy. Literally what thermite does, what thermite and WP does, is it gets stuck to your skin, and it yeah. just burns. It doesn't come off. To get it off, you can't, like, water it down, and you can't, like, scrape it off. You, you have to, like, dig a knife into your skin and carve out your skin to get it off of you. I have a throbbing erection. I know you do, you fuck. You <laughs> sick fuck. Hey, don't judge me. War gets me hard. <laughs> I've got a boner for murder. <laughs> hey. Are you playing? The best kind of surgery is done with a shotgun! <laughs> you ever watch Ash vs. the Evil Dead? Yes. Yes. It's like my favorite movie of all time. Then they made another one. Then they, uh... What was it? Uh, then they fucking made that series. They, I don't know if you've seen the TV series of it. Uh -huh. But it's fucking amazing. It's continuing like everything and it's fucking hilarious.
Yeah. That was a fun one. Sean, I got raped by donuts yesterday. <laughs> what? <laughs> so there's a meme in Mega Man X6 called getting raped by donuts. And good luck with them donuts, bro. It's because there's giant metal donuts with spikes and fucking cylinders on them that <laughs> shoot fucking lasers. Oh, yes. I yeah, you have to that. kill four of them. Can you chill the fuck out, please? That's not chilling out. Can you relax, please, for the love of God? <laughs> I like how my dog's not as hyper as Please? Get down. Get down. Last time you were up there, you peed on the bed. Get down. Oh, my Get dog down. doesn't pee on the bed. She peed on the bed once, and she got in trouble for it. <laughs> That's piss! <laughs> Yep, that's Pierce. <laughs> My dog's sitting here getting her belly rubs. What pup? You have fucking look up to <laughs> What? Ow. What are all these gulags for? It's a surprise tool that will help us later. Optimus Prime is shooting laser beams at me! You're right there. <laughs> that means he's afraid of Santa Claus. Stop it, Patrick! You're scaring him! It's that except it's a feminist. What does that mean? It means she's afraid. She's afraid of men. <laughs> Stop it, Patrick! You're right here. Fight the fight! Mumble it. What? Huh? What? Huh? What? My dog doesn't get vocal with me. It must be a husky thing. Yeah. Husky's a very vocal. What? Huh? Huh? What? Don't you pull my blanket off my bed, you piece of shit! You piece of shit! <laughs> Listen here then, cowboy, I'm about to fucking just get back here. I will destroy you. Did you just tell your dog you were gonna destroy it? What? So did you just tell your dog you were gonna destroy it? Yeah. God damn it, this fucking level's confusing as shit to me. out! Oh my god. So Sean, I don't know if I told you this since you've been gone for a few days, but uh, my uh, 
You know my female roommate, Savannah? Yeah, she like stepped on a dill of glass the other day and like bled all over the house. Hot. I know, right? Sign me up for another. <laughs> Sign me up for another. <laughs> no, but I. I uh, fucking, I got her peroxide instead of alcohol rub, and they're like, you know that deteriorates her skin, right? Like, she could scar and stuff, and I'm just sitting here like, yep. I'm like, you told me to get something to stop the bleeding and clean the wound. I got you that. <laughs> you were healed, but at a cost. Oh, I actually took my fucking razor, so I wasn't able to shave for like the past few fucking days. You have an electric razor? Or, uh... Oh no, it's a regular. Stole my fucking razor. She was just... fucking shower. It's fair. And I'm like, I'm not gonna use it because I'm pretty sure it's touched your cooter. <laughs> You're like, does this mean I put it on my dick? <laughs> Is that what this means? What do I do? I, I, I've thought about it. Oh my god. Change my Xbox name to mutilated foreskin. Stop! Ow! <laughs> <laughs> oh, fucking... God, it's got rape bubbles. Nope, they're cum bubbles. I take it back. Take it all back. Every time I see Sammy, fucking <laughs> sign it on, I'm just like, God damn it, I die a little on the inside. Just because his name is Young God Sammy now? Yep. Ray Aaron. Are you gonna go get it and bring it back, or are you just gonna fucking attack it and then not bring it back? Just let me fight cum Bubble McGee and beat this fucking game already. Get your paw out of your water bowl, fuck.
Let me kill you, cunt. I want you to die. Good God Almighty. Suck me sideways, Jimmy. Do you mind? My Jesus. dog got a fucking terrible haircut, so her tufts of fur on her butt make it look like she has really big butt cheeks. <laughs> My God. Bless you, Simpai. Oh my god, how do I beat you, you fat floppy cunt? When someone says, oh shut up, you know you love me, I'd sell you to Satan for one card <laughs> <laughs> Did you see the other one? Uh, no, I didn't see the other one. Fuck. Uh, me. Fuck a relationship. I need to focus on myself and only myself. Hot person. Hey, me. No question about it. I'm ready to get hurt again. <laughs> <laughs> no question about it. It's fucking funny. I just, I love The Office, so that was... I actually have never seen The Office. You need to watch it, it's really good. It's I love the the guy that plays the boss, but I hear like the last few seasons just go to shit. No. It's sad. It's a sad show. I mean it's a sad show. It's a sad. The end, it's a sad. Got a single fucking e tank. <sighs> oh, she's stretching out. Don't even. What the fuck was that? Knock it off! It's 
Stop it! Why are you such a cunt licker? <laughs> My roommate's like, you know, if your dog ever misbehaves, she knows that I'll kick her right in the cut. <laughs> Knock it off! And Sean's getting raped by his dog. It was inevitable. Come here. You stop it. This is the fabled town. Wait, 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 are you playing Fallout again? No. Oh, god damn it, you're playing Pokemon. <laughs> Lavender Town. Oh, boy. All of these Pokemon graves. I want to just get into like a Pokemon fight where like the Pokemon actually die, and you just hear the other trainer you're fighting like, "Oh God, Jigglypuff, why?" There's a whole like theory about how you kill your rival uh, Raticate in this game.
permanent license after 21, so now they don't have to show that fucking bullshit piece of paper every time I go to the bar. Nice. Even though I haven't gone since uh, Josiah and Avery went with me. Yeah. I guess I gotta go for a hunt for the E tanks now. All I do that is Mega Man. exists as a thin gas, it can topple an Indian elephant by enveloping the prey in two seconds. Damn, Ghastly! What the fuck? <laughs> an Indian elephant. It is said to cry loudly. Well, damn. Damn, Cubone. Okay, so now I've made it to the final stages of this game. That's not what I meant to do, god damn it, Billy Bob. God damn it, Jimbo. My name's Jim Bob Jer Jans. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? What is this game? Hey goes. Uh, there was Marlock and it was like a ghost blocks your path you can't go on and it says like be gone intruders. And then, uh, the ghost gets identified with a self scope, but it's the Marowak, and it straight up is just like, the ghost was the, uh, it was the ghost of Cubone's dead mother, the, 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 this game is so dark! Dude, there's a literal Pokemon that if it doesn't, uh, if it doesn't keep moving, its heart stops. Ready? Pokemon, what the fuck? 
You know the 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 sand castle Pokemon in the new Alola region? Yeah. You know its picture for it eating food is it drowning a Pikachu in sand and eating it. Are you serious? Look it up. They tried to make it cute, but it only it only fueled nightmares. What the fuck? Game, what the fuck? Wait, let me grab him. Placement is so Holy fuck, it is. Yeah, you saw the picture of the Pikachu dying? Jesus. <laughs> Holy fuck it is. That was about the response I was expecting. Oh my god. You know Drifloon? You know the cute little fucking uh, balloon Pokemon? Yeah, I remember this one, but I don't remember what exactly it is. But I remember it has the fucking dark form. Yeah, it carries children to the afterlife. Yeah. Except fat kids. They go to hell. <laughs> you can't carry <laughs> Yeah, no, that's a, literally in its description. It's like, it, it dislikes heavy people. Uh, I don't know if you saw it, but fucking, uh, they released a new video for, uh, Dorkly, and it's about more of the dark shit about Pokemon. Are you serious? Yeah, and so it's just a video of like all of them and their interactions with their dark stuff. Jesus. Thank God, there's a shit one here. So, Sean, my cat died? It, wait, what? Our cat died. How? Just died. How? Uh, it had a, uh, infection in its, uh, 
oh. lungs, and it just like never recovered. Oh. So my roommate, who really liked the cat, and I, even I was like, "Damn, I like this cat," purely for the fact like it annoyed me because I just don't like cats in general. But as far as cats go, I was like, oh, "I really like your cat." Yeah, no, fucking little bitch gets taken into the fucking vet clinic and then he has to get her put down and I felt so sorry for him dude cause like he's been kinda like he's been like hiding it but I can tell he's kinda moody yeah and I'm just like god damn poor motherfucker cat died and everything so he's still at the fucking cat box right next to his fucking desk too and I'm just like that is that is sad God damn it, really, game? Man, I wish it would show more camera up top. I want to fight one of these things in the background. Let me do it. Let me do it. What the fuck is this? What the fuck is this shit? Ah, so small like... Can catch Snorlax, yes? Please? Can catch Snorlax? Yes, please! Oh, you motherfucker. Clever, but not good enough. Bullshit! Fuck. 
You get raped by Snorlax? No, I'm trying to catch the Snorlax, and it's got a move that it keeps using repeatedly. Pissing me off. Up. What the fuck? Fucking bullshit. Did it kill you? No. This is fucking bullshit. Did you accidentally kill it? No. Get the fuck. You snore, you cunt. <laughs> you snore, you cunt. <laughs> Very angry with his I dare you. Three. Caught him! Fuck you! God damn! It took five great balls to catch that fucker. So, Sean, I just recently acquired a Switch. Oh, that's great, dude. This Twitch is awesome. And I'm gonna start You're streaming. Gonna get so you can play. I'm, oh yeah, exactly. And I'm also gonna start streaming uh, Switch games because Ryan Ryan got Kirby. Possibly. It's Ryan's Switch, by the way. Yeah, I'm just make, making that apparent. Not like, oh, I went out and bought it because I've been spending a lot of money on my dog lately, so I know that that's no my book. Yeah. Uh, it is not satisfied unless it eats over 880 pounds of food every day. When it is done eating, it goes properly to sleep. Cool. Give a nickname to the Snorlax? Fat cunt. Fuck you. Fat cunt! Not name him. He doesn't deserve it. Red received the super rod. I'll give you my super rod. Just kidding. That's gay. Hey, spell kid backwards. Uh, dick. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You're searching for a moonstone? You're searching in the wrong area, camp for Justin. Go to the caves, there's plenty of them. I found like three. I need to use one of them to evolve my Clefairy. Are you streaming your Pokemon game or what? Well, I fucking wish! Can't stream bootleg games. Uh, <laughs> but you can. You can. <laughs> I've I've seen streamers do it and not have any repercussions for uh, their actions. They're supposed to be. But it's really like, just they're supposed like, to get in trouble. But but it's really just like who the fuck cares? Nintendo does. And it's just because Nintendo. The only reason I know that is because fucking Nintendo is like suing. God damn it! Stop streaming guy. our games and stop uploading them to YouTube. And we're like, fuck off. <laughs> oh, let's send out magic crap. Magic crap. Hey. It's a bad Pokemon. Only thing is good for is forget Gyarados. Get Gyarados. I fucking love Gyarados. Gyarados might be one of my favorite Pokemon, especially the red one. Yeah. Mother tit sucker. I'm gonna 
hope these fucking fly guys let me the fuck out. What do you mean the shiny guy does? Yeah. The one you get from the uh, rail. silver or heart gold. Yeah, that one is like, well the uh, shiny Pokemon are like, you have to, you have to hunt for them. They're just rare versions of the same Pokemon. See, but it's actually like a mission to get it in fucking in that game though. Hmm. I need to play Heart Gold and Soul Silver. Awesome, better than that. Have you never played them? No, I've played Fire Red, Ruby Red, and uh, Leaf Green. <laughs> you know, Ruby's like, uh, <laughs> just right after it, so it's like you skipped a happy good fun time. I just, the, those are the games that I have. It's not that I didn't want to play them, it's just those are the ones I had. I know, I'm just giving you shit because. <laughs> yeah. You like leapfrogged it. But they weren't like my games, they were my brother's games. And he was like, oh, you like Pokemon better than I do. Mm. Mm. Gave me his games, and now I don't know where they are, I'm pissed. How is he not taking damage? North to Silence Bridge.
thinking about giving my dog a fucking bath tonight. She needs it. She's just been outside a lot. Yo, did you see uh, the news for Siege? No. Uh, the two new operators were revealed. But, but they got their, their reveal. And they released what the map is gonna, what map is getting a rework. What map would that be? Airford. What? Airford base is getting a complete rework. Hmm. And it looks fucking sick. It's supposed to, uh, it's supposed to, um, be more accurate to the book. Rainbow Six the Clancy novel. Watching a deal for item locations because I don't have the shit I need. Six sub tank locations. Here we go. I'm gonna end this stream right here and call it good.